Stripping the old finish off of furniture before staining is not always necessary. If the finish is in good condition, gel stain can be used to refresh the wood. Before starting, I wet sanded the areas that were going to be stained with 320 grit sandpaper, making sure not to take off the original finish. I then let them dry for a few hours before I began staining. For this project, I'm using General Finishes Gel Stain in Java, applied with a foam poly brush and staining pads to remove the excess stain. Make sure you're wearing gloves and apply an even coat of gel stain, working with the grain of the wood. I wouldn't want to change a thing. There is nothing to decide here. In the winter that you bring. And I just want to be here tonight. Yeah, I just want to be here. Wipe off all the excess stain using a clean staining pad. I wiped the whole surface down about four times, looking carefully to be sure there were no streaks or marks left. We'll be staring down the gun. Now the words don't for me, is it? It's okay to turn and run. When the noose is touched loosely, we'll be staring down the gun. But I was in my heart, giving you. Wait 24 hours for the stain to fully dry and seal the finish with a top coat of your choice. I use General Finishes High Performance Top Coat in satin, applied with a 2 inch synthetic bristle brush. I said I wish it wasn't like this